The Bitium Respiro device is intended to be used as a prescribed screening device for sleep apnea. For the recording, you will need the following equipment. Bitium Respiro device, pulse oximeter, Respiro patch for two rip belts. A spare patch is included. Nasal cannula, two rip belts. Medical tape, Respiro ECG adapter, Bitium Omega Snap 1CH ECG electrode. Keep the device and accessories out of reach of children and pets. These accessories are single use items. If needed, remove body hair using a razor or electric shaver. Clean skin according to the instructions given by your healthcare professional. The skin should be clean and dry when attaching the electrode. Make sure the Omega Snap 1CH ECG electrode pouch is unopened before use. Tear open the pouch and remove the electrode. Snap the Respiro ECG adapter to the electrode. The electrode and the adapter are now connected. Remove plastic liner number one from the electrode. Do not touch the adhesive surface with your fingers. Attach the electrode to the sternum. Place the top of the electrode the width of approximately two fingers below the suprasternal notch. The bottom of the electrode should reach just above the diaphragm. When the electrode is properly attached, remove the liners from the sides. Wear a shirt over the electrode. Pull the opposite end of the adapter above the shirt's neckline. Align snaps on the back of the Respiro device with the snaps on the adapter. Press the device against the adapter to make sure the snap fasteners are securely fastened. Use the Respiro patch for two rip belts. There is a spare patch available to be used only as a backup option. Align snaps on the back of the Respiro device with the snaps on the back of the Respiro patch for two rip belts. Press the device against the patch to properly snap the fasteners in place. Open the rip belt pouch. If needed, adjust the belt for a comfortable and secure fit throughout the night. Attach the rip belt to the patch. Put the rip belt on the wire side up. Attach the other side of the rip belt to the opposite end of the patch. Align the Respiro device to the center of the thorax. Rip belts must not be worn against the skin. Open the second rip belt pouch. Put the second rip belt around your waist and snap into place. Attach the cannula to the Respiro device by rotating the connector clockwise until it is securely connected. Do not use excessive force when connecting the nasal cannula. Position the nasal cannula into the nostrils. Adjust the fit by moving the slider up to the tube. Use medical tape to secure the cannula. Place the pulse oximeter on your wrist. Ensure the wristband fits comfortably. Do not over tighten the wristband. Apply the sensor to your index finger. If you are wearing nail polish, it must be removed before using the sensor. Use medical tape for securing the sensor. The pulse oximeter will start automatically and connect to the Respiro device. To start the recording, press the power button for three seconds until all three LED indicators are illuminated in blue. Press the power button again for about eight seconds until the device vibrates once and all three of the LEDs start blinking blue. To indicate the device is ready to begin recording, all three LEDs will be illuminated in green. Now you are ready to go to sleep. After the measurement, 
Stop the recording by pressing the power button for three seconds. The device will vibrate three times and the LED indicators will illuminate in blue from left to right until all lights are blue. Remove all equipment from your body. Your pulse oximeter will turn off automatically once you remove the sensor from your finger. If needed, you can use mild soapy water to remove the electrode from the skin. After the measurement is completed, return the equipment to your clinic. Dispose of the used single-use items by following your local waste practices. Thank you for watching. For more information, please contact your local clinic or visit the Bitium website, bitium.com.